So in today's video, I'm going to be showcasing all the high tier loot spawns on labs. I'm talking about lead X, GPUs, the hard to get hideout items, and everything in between. So first we'll start off at the hangar gate. There's a total of one rare spawn inside the button room here, as well as a PC. Next we have weapon testing. I'll go over this room again later in the video, but there's two high value spawns inside here. So we've got two high value spawns right here and here, as well as a Intel folder on this table. So now a couple technical spawns, one on the table, on these containers and on the shelf, some technical items. As well as on the ground and on these containers, and then an intel folder on this table. Inside of mini med here, there's some more high value spawns. Now under green dark offices, there are shelves. They're not really worth checking. Uh, I've found a Bitcoin once or twice, some gold chains here. It's also a bunch of PCs. Moving up to dark green office here. There's some more high value spawns. A few spawns on this shelf, maybe a figurine or gold chain. Now inside dark yellow office, there's just a couple shelves with maybe a gold chain figurine spawn, as well as a safe. No super high value items inside this office. Moving into parking garage, there's one spawn at the end of the yellow line between the cars here. Inside the button room, there's two high value spawns and one PC. Now, inside admin office or Intel office, got a couple shelves with spawns on it, on a Bitcoin here, Intel. And then three rare spawns on the ground. In these shelves there's a rare spawn. And then the last one on the table. Round table or a lot of people call it cat. You've got one high value spawn on top of the table. Two on the ground and then an intel folder on the top of the table. The last high value spawn I want to mention inside server room is a Letex spawn on this table. It's very rare though. There's a few offices on the first and second floor here by the blue keycard room where you can find some loose medical supplies, some loose stimulants.
directly above the blue key card room here at the sector G elevator. There's a few more rooms. Now I want to cover the key card spawns. So in the cafeteria, we have a yellow key card on top of the table here. Inside of red slash violet room, you have a green key card on the shelf all the way in the back. Now at manager's office, there's a green key card spawn on this table. As well as inside this conference room, there's a yellow key card on the table there. Now very quickly, three card spawns coming up. We've got a yellow on this table. A black on this table. And another black key card right here. Inside blue keycard room, there's a green keycard spawn on this table here. And then the last one, inside green room, there's another black keycard spawn at this, this monitor. Moving on to the locked rooms now. This one's weapon testing. We've got a gun spawn on the rack there. Bunch of attachments, ammo, two high value spawns, and a couple weapon boxes. Manager's office key. This room is pretty risky to loot if the lobby's not completely dead. But you've got a safe, two large weapon crates, PC, and then a few high value spawns on the ground and table there. So now black room. I personally always enter through these double doors and if anyone runs up, I can just swing out of these double doors kind of unexpected. Pretty self-explanatory where the loot is. If you have this key card, you most likely know. You, know. you can find stims and lead X in here. Inside red room, the violet key card. There are some high value spawns on the shelf and on the ground on top of this filing cabinet. Inside the chair here. And then the last one on the shelf. Last locked room I'm going to cover is the yellow key card. I definitely recommend getting yellow, violet, black weapon testing managers. Two high value spawns, one in either one of the chairs here. <laughs> 